And what latest from stock markets, Asian markets, they edged high today as investors clung to hopes that pace of U.S. global rate hike will start to slow. The U.S. futures, they dropped after disappointing results from tech giants Alphabet and Microsoft. E-mini futures for S&P 500, they fell 1% in early trade after Google owner Alphabet posted softer than expected ad sales after Bell and Microsoft missed expectations. Possibly early signs of slowdown, it is in the U.S. economy and mainland Chinese benchmark. Meanwhile, they advanced 1% while Hong Kong stocks were up 2%, attempting another rebound after Monday's deep sell-off in Chinese assets by global investors who were worried about Beijing's policy direction. U.S. economic data yesterday showed slowing home price growth and soaring consumer confidence with some signs that the Federal Reserve's aggressive interest rate hikes are starting to cool labor market. In currency markets, dollar flirted with the three-week low versus major peers, while sterling hung close to six-week peak reached yesterday after new British Prime Minister Rishi Sunak pledged to lead country out of an economic crisis. The pound was last trading at $1.1445, down 0.19%. Meanwhile, oil prices, they were down. As industry data showed, U.S. crude oil stockpiles were up more than expected, reinforcing fears of global recession that would cut demand. Brent crude futures for December dropped $1.17 or 1.3% to $92.35 a barrel. We on now available in your country. Download the app and get all the news on the move.